Here uh, with me is Israel Kurun. He's the coach of this football team. And they're now in Shillong and is coaching this Goa team. Can you tell me uh, something about your Goa team? Yeah, hi. Uh, it's, it's, I'm a uh, present. I, I'm coaching in FC Goa, which is an ISL team. Now I, I'm, my team is taking a participate in, in this Duran Cup. So we are, we are here living in right now. I'm in Shillong. So just we're enjoying the place and the weather. It's, it's really, really wonderful. You know, Israel uh, and I, first time we met today, but we had known each other for the last eight years. And he has a very, very good testimony uh, how when he was going through uh, some injury, because he was playing uh, from some other clubs, and uh, he can tell you about those clubs and how he got injured. Then he went for treatment and finally it was God who intervened and he can play again. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was, it was a very, very tough time. As we know, like a football, you know, it's a, it's a physical, physical challenge and a physical contact game. So I was going through a very, very bad phase. Like I have, I have injured my knee and I've gone to a surgery. I have did a lot of rehabilitation, you know, then I finally, I think we, we, we talked on a phone eight years ago. So even he has prayed a lot for me and thank you, thank you very much for the, for all the things that, that if I can remember, you know, and finally, yes. The hard work that, that God blessed me, God blessed me and again I started playing playing football for, for quite a long time and now I am very, very, very much happy that I have spent my playing career, now being as a coach, now everything is alright. I think sometimes being a, being a sportsman, we, we forget, we forget there is, there is someone above us but when we start to, start to seek his help or, or the blessings that we get from him, it's, it's, it's really amazing. Uh, wonderful how I uh, came in contact with him. You see, uh, one of his aunties, she was studying in a Bible college called Kohima Bible College in Nagaland. And at that time, my wife also, uh, she was uh, not married to me. At, uh, she was single. Uh, my wife, she is from Nagaland. And uh, she, she was her classmates and the, uh, very good friends. And later on, after... My wife uh, and I were, uh, you know, uh, were married and uh, we came to Shillong and stayed here. Uh, I have a, a Facebook account and his auntie, she used to uh, follow me. Then one day I uh, got a message in box about her that uh, her nephew, uh, one of her nephews, his name is Israel Kurung. He, he was uh, playing with some club football and then he got injured. And uh, he was taken for surgery and treatment, but it seemed nothing worked. So she was asking me to please pray for him. So I said, okay, uh, later on, we got connected by uh, phone. And from that time on, uh, eight years back, uh, since we came in touch with one other, I used to pray. Uh, with him a lot on the phone now and then and sometimes send messages he sent messages to me but we never met till today uh, we came uh, you know uh, in touch on a personal basis I'm so happy uh, uh, to have him on this channel that uh, he can tell you more about his uh, Christian experience how you met Jesus and uh, you know but you went to school in Shillong? Yes, yes, yes. Tell yes. me, uh, when was that? Uh, it was a long time back, you know, like uh, I was here. So for me, this place is like, I feel that it's, it's, it's very, 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 very beautiful. And like, it's very close to me. One of the, I, I feel one of the best place in India, I must say, I to, if I'm very honest. So see, as a, as a, as a player, like, you know, I, I, I was born in a Christian family. You know, sometimes when we, when we grow, when we, we when we become popular or when we reach in some level, you know that the pride comes in. That is, I have to be very honest. I will, will be very honest with you guys. So sometimes we forget. Sometimes we think like you know the, that the, that is all because of our own strength, our knowledge, understanding. But the fact, the truth is, is that there is, there is some mercies, you know, the God's mercies on us. That is where that is where the God's help us to be somewhere else. He takes us to some height, but sometimes we forget. 
So that is that is the time I feel like you know there is there is a God's way of bringing us back, and that is that is where I feel like you know that that injured that I was here, I met you on the phone and you you prayed for me. That that is all the all the things that God has planned. I I feel, but today I will I'll tell tell all the people you know those who are here. There is some some something above us that is God, you know. So whatever we are doing, we we need to praise God at the end of the day. That is His His willingness, His mercies, His his blessings that is all will take us to some some extent so for me christ is everything now uh, after i become a coach i as i recall sometimes the people that i met in my journey it's all it's all god wish and maybe i think you know like i could have not met many people if 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 i don't know you know the jesus or something because one way or other i met you it was it was a it was a good thing because you prayed for me without knowing each other that is that is how i am i am very thankful to you as well and today i met finally after 8 years it's a, it's a great day it's it's one of the great day i i, I feel the grace of god yeah. and all because of the grace of god so thank you so much uh, uh you were doing this in english but let me address those who are listening uh, from the local dialect in khasi they are hanging around but only when you prepare football program u isel gorong but mentau long u coach ya ne ke team ka ba ile duran cup baudan po shalong take my first time mensha uni u la ile football na du urang kam kena sama he de ka por ka ya kom tu na ile ne ki club ka tu ane dia wega pot pot u yo ya ne ga jimpang ka kejat nambar ba don ge jimpang sao de la lei pa samar yo pari alam bonyo ji samar gi hostel ki ba katoni jakane po india nrei kai gi bukan le operation surgery ba gini kita ke ji bersang banjarap na kaleng berkel sense ya klam mo ra eta ka ji yo ge ji pencha bu pura ya ne ga kejat ka bu sitom Ewa em ka jing em ka jing do jing ka men de kum ta ka puor ngayo ka we ka message ha ka facebook ka jonga de ke ba sutrat ha ni ka long ba ka ni ba pak message ka ri ka anti jong u israel bat ka ya puri lang men chua bat i lok jonga ha po ka bible college ha kohima kohima bible college de ka kala i tu i bat ha din ka i pat wa da be to ma ka bat i Tega follow ini ke Facebook, bat kasi iba. Kumpul no beli ulah kiki kambak aja sayang. Bafer, bafer keleng ker India, keleng ker Australia. Bagi elap, keleng keleng kuat sini selong ru bagi ba. Pala pala gigi jingja kambak aja mau beli. Tega pa tu inbox message, main tu sepang jong u dan kambing the white, dan kambing Merkel kambak aja mau beli. Tega nang tageng nisa connect lang kumpul ni Israel bat menga. Tega phone si phone de saya sedang bandua yang dulu nang tag. Ya suki suki ke kejat ke jong upat ke yo ke jing pankia ba pura ba hadin ko to wa le football dan ka malaysia bat mentau dun selong nam tai de ka doran cup bat nga songo ublay nam arbang impat ji kandu marhamat nam marmet tam ta ka sehi de ke pentau ke jing songo e ublay ko mu ublay tu ke ibu ublay le ke jing ko jong upat ni lam yo ba la ban ci riu trai de ke ne long ru ko buat ke nosam baro ba jong ru ke jing e Let's say about Jesus who done when you're away from here. I was just telling that if there's any difficulty, they can just call on Jesus. He's always there to help them. God bless you. God bless you, Bon. And you want to say anything? Yeah, there is always above us, the God, Jesus Christ. Whatever problem, maybe I think we are in this world. You know, it's a difficult time. Every people will face a problem, but there is always a hope. You can hope. You can you can pray, you can cry. There is always a Christ who is gonna hear us. That is that is the only message that I, what I've experienced till now. Whenever I face a problem, maybe sometimes you know we we think like because of our wisdom, our knowledge, our strength, we can do many things. But that is that is all at the end of the day. That is all you know. If there is a, no God's mercy on us, I don't think we can achieve anything. So guys, please don't feel shame. Because the God is 
is i don't know i can i cannot i cannot explain it's it's a huge blessing for me and to meet him as well the prayer that he did to me it was it was really really amazing if when i talk i get the goosebumps of here because the problem that i was facing was it was a very very bad phase so god sends the right people at the right time so i'm very very happy thank you very much pastor for for all the prayers you know that you have done for me for my family for my kids for my team as well he's been praying so thank you thank you so You're much <laughs> okay god bless you and uh, uh, the lord be with you and remember if it is any problem in your life right now just call on jesus stand with jesus and the poor can now quite get with jesus he is always there to help you don't drink at sanda ban yarao if he thank you